Hey guys, welcome to Men's Grooming Advice. If you're new here, make sure to hit subscribe for weekly videos for skincare, fragrance reviews and tips for confidence to help you be the best version of you. My regular viewers will know that I love wet shaving and even though I'm now sporting some facial hair, I still must keep my neck smooth and the edges clean. The downside to this is that I've always, and I do mean always, suffered from razor burn. Because of this, I'm always looking for the perfect post-shave balm. This is a relatively new product in the UK. It's the Mr. Cool Aftershave Balm um, from the Raw Naturals, which is a product line from Recipe for Men. Now, full confession here, I've only ever tried one product from Recipe for Men, which was a daytime moisturiser with SPF. It was one of the first products I actually reviewed on this channel, and I totally trashed it. Easily one of the worst moisturisers that I've ever tried, not particularly cheap at £25. So I've not been in a hurry to try another of their products. But I had a request from a subscriber to look at their latest addition to the UK skincare market. And as this shave balm is reasonably priced at £10, I decided to give it a try. So the product claims that this refreshing aftershave balm helps fight post-shave dryness, razor burn and redness. A special menthol blend provides a long-lasting cooling effect. It also says it's naturally, natural skin care for men brewed locally. So. so second on the ingredient list after water is coconut oil. Now coconut oil is found across a wide spectrum of skin care from body butters and makeup removers to sunburn relief and of course post-shave soothing. Oat oil is included to help reduce redness and irritation and allotonin, which is a common post-shave ingredient, aids skin repair, reduces irritation and helps to prevent the transepidermal water loss. The description talks about their special menthol blend that provides a lasting cooling effect. This blend is methyl ethylamido oxalate, which is a synthetic menthol derivative and gives a distinct cooling effect on the skin, which tends to last around about 10 to 30 minutes. In use, it's more watery than a lot of aftershave balms, which I take as a good thing, as it absorbs quickly into the skin. Application is easy, with a small amount work to put in the palms of your hands and then smooth across the face and neck. It takes almost no effort to work the remainder into the skin and you are immediately met with the cooling effect I just mentioned. I did find the scent slightly overpowering on use, but that faded quickly and that was generally just when it's right underneath my nose. The skin's less smooth and hydrated with just a slight tingle and you should of course follow this with use of moisturiser and sun protection. So I've been using this for the last couple of weeks and been pleased with it, the results. Um, it's a light and effective treatment that has made my skin feel much less sensitive in comparison to many other brands, including a few that are considerably more expensive. At just £10, this is really good value and I can see a tube easily lasting two or three months of daily use. Have you tried this yet? If so, how did you get on? Would you like me to review more of the Raw Naturals range? Let me know in the comment section below. And let us all know in the comments below what's your favourite post-shave treatment. So I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did don't forget to give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already done so and come follow me over on Instagram. I've been Bear Clark, you've been amazing and I'll see you again real soon.